viewers, welcome to my kitchen. Today I am making wet coleslaw sandwich with a healthy twist. If you are trying to lose your weight like me, you can add this sandwich in a diet plan. So let's start. We need carrots, onion and lemon, spinach, mushrooms, cabbage, French beans, coriander, tofu, spinach leaves, thick hung curd, whole wheat bread slices, crushed black pepper, tomato sauce and salt. First heat up your pan and when your pan is hot add very finely chopped carrots French beans and mushrooms and also add very little salt on these vegetables because the salt will help in releasing the moisture. Now without adding a single drop of oil saute these vegetables on a medium flame. So can you see the moisture of these vegetables? Now you need to saute all these vegetables. I like the crunch so I will cook them partially. So cook on a medium flame. So when these vegetables are done, add very finely chopped spinach leaves and also add very finely chopped cabbage. If you don't want to cook them, you can skip it. Here I am not adding my chopped onions because I like raw onions in my sandwiches. If you want, you can also add your onions. Now saute for 1 to 2 minutes until these vegetables are soft. So cook and keep on stirring continuously. So when these vegetables are done, let them cool down completely. So my vegetables are cool now. Now take a big bowl like this and add your thick hung curd. I am using low fat curd for this recipe. Now add 1 tablespoon of tomato sauce. You can add any kind of sauce of your choice. It is just to add the flavors. Now mix both of them together. If your curd is too tight or thick, you can add 1 to 2 tablespoon of water or milk. So after mixing both of them together, now add salt as per your taste and also add fresh black pepper now again you need to mix them together now add your chopped onions your cooked vegetables fresh tofu fresh coriander leaves and lime juice now Mix all these vegetables with your low fat curd properly. Now take two bread slices. If you want you can also cut the sides of your bread. Now apply your mixture on your bread slice. Try to fill all the sides without leaving any gap because we want filling in every bite of this sandwich. Now join both these bread slices. If you want you can also cut these bread slices into two half. Also add fresh spinach leaves. This will give amazing look and crunch in your sandwiches. You can do one more thing. Heat your tawa or griddle and roast these bread slices from both the sides until they are a bit crispy and light golden in color or you can serve them as it is and your sandwiches are ready do you like this recipe share your experiences by commenting below you can also visit to my website www.sharmakitchen.com for the detailed written recipe and some tips and tricks you can like me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter. You will get all the links in my description box below. For such more amazing recipes, do subscribe to Sharma's Kitchen. Thanks for watching.